All right, man. I've been seeing Ren's gonna drop a video. He's finally dropped it. It, it almost looks like he's in Seattle. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, that that could be Canada. I'm not sure, man. But let's get right into it. Fred again, mash up. Let's see what he's got for us. So I like that with the guitar, he he makes almost kind of um. I mean, in, in hip hop, you have what's called a bar. I mean, you know, there's the the phrase bars in hip hop, but what I'm referring to is more like the musical bar, and there's four bars, and then usually there's some variation within the four bars, but there's typically a loop. Um, and so I like that what, what Ren seems to be able to do when he plays acoustic and does some live is, uh, is, is he's able to cre recreate, um, you know, that that beat in that four bar pattern with uh, taps and certain more pronounced strums with the acoustic guitar, which I think is really cool. Um, and yeah, as far as the, the content, as far as the lyrical content, I'm not entirely sure what this is about, but, um, you know. Let's keep rolling with it. Ain't no love in the jungle. Ain't no, 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 ain't no, no, oh, ain't no love in the jungle. Ain't no, 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 pull me out of this. It's weird he's saying ain't no love in the jungle um, because there's a – you guys are going to hate me, but um, I, I don't know if it's Curtis Mayfield, but the ain't no love in the heart of the city um, is is a classic um, classic American song. And so um, ain't no love in the jungle, you know, that's an interesting phrase. I know the projects or, or certain projects are referred to as a concrete jungle um, and also just the – you know, could also be referring to the wild. So – that that's an interesting phrase. Um, just wanted to point that out. So is he doing, it's a mashup. So is he doing a cover of somebody named Fred? I, once again, you guys always get in the comments and you're like, man, how do you not know this? What, Freddie Mercury? Oh man, I'm risk. I'm risking, I'm pissing a lot of you guys off, man. But I'm, I'm genuinely curious. I, I'm a big hip hop person. So outside of that, I only really know what people tell me about. Um, I don't do a lot of exploration. I mean, there's a lot of great music outside of hip hop, but it's um, the spoken word poetry is is really my um, bread and butter. So interesting, though. I'm curious, you know, how much is original? How much is a cover? Is it a mashup uh, of covering a certain artist? You guys let me know. You guys are awesome, by the way. You're great with that. Everybody on the little mission. Money makes you go, go missing, missing. I get any wall in or in store, in store. Everybody, 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 leave me alone. Her boobies getting lifted. <laughs> Man, so he said, you know, on a mission, and then basically when you're chasing the money, it's it turns missing. So, like, your mission is missing when you're. 
um, you know, strictly pursuing the money. That's the way I interpreted those two lines anyway. And I butchered the phraseology. I'm just trying to digest. I try to digest the concept. Some people think I screw up the lyrics on purpose. It's like, no, but I I try to pick up what they're putting down in, in any, um, you know, wordplay, double entendres that may be available. In on Insta, Insta, everybody, 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 leave me alone. Her boobies getting lifted, lifted. She wanna get lit, 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 lit. Fucking up, I'm bottling, I'm bottling, I'm bottling. Everybody, 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 everybody. Leave me alone, alone, alone. Leave me alone, alone, alone. Leave me alone, alone, alone. Leave me alone. Cause I reach my soul. Man, and then the the louder strum becomes the snare. I don't know if you guys caught that. Hello. That's cool, man. Very long. See, so Ren, I, I said it earlier, but Ren, anytime I've seen him do an acoustic or, um, uh, you know, but it seems like he's able to keep that four bar structure and then, um, you know, he, he'll essentially, he can use it um, in order in order to rap or do an acoustic cover of one of his hip hop songs, um, which I actually like. I, I like to do the live as well as the, um, you know, kind of studio hip hop version. Um, I, I just like the live sound. I really do. I'm a sucker for it. Um, I just, in this day and age, there's so much. And e e oddly enough, even Ren does a lot of like EDM elements in a lot of his hip hop um, focused music, which I'm not personally a huge fan of EDM and the hip hop mixture. Ren does it okay sometimes. Um, but I, I just do like the classic sound of an acoustic. You know, call me crazy. Oh. Won't be very long Though the night is dark It keeps me holding on God bless my soul It won't be very long Though the night is dark It keeps me holding on I've been lost, I've been lost, I've been lost, I've been lost for a while. But I'm really trying. I've been lost, I've been lost, I've been lost, I've been lost for a while. But I'm really trying I've been lost, I've been lost I've been lost, I've been lost for a while a sick boy emblem yeah man so rent rent is i mean so think about how many times he just switched tempo in that four and a half minutes um you know it seemed like he switched tempo multiple times obviously mood um and once again i don't know if he's covering a bunch of songs or not i'm going into this blind but um the mere fact that he can switch tempos like that like a live performance it's, it's one thing to keep a, a similar tempo for three and a half minutes. Once you get that tempo down, you can pretty much do it. But being able to switch tempos, switch moods, um, you know, obviously lyrics, and then I don't know what he's switching as far as chords and, and 
all that stuff. It's way above my head. I'm just a basic boom bap beat type of guy but um i do know the ability to switch um switch up like that is is very difficult especially in a live performance so i i wonder how many times ren rehearsed that before um getting in front of a camera and doing it um yeah definitely interesting guys definitely interesting but i'm gonna wrap this one up got a bunch of ren reactions on the channel if you like the video feel free to like subscribe comment and recommend or not whatever whatever works for you guys thank you